on. That's it. That's the Polestar Twin 6000. We're going to do a loop here. going to take the controls. Here we go. You know, I was going with the rudder because the FBI, I've been steering it with the rudder. <laughs> Let's see a do a barrel roll or something. Roll? Yeah, let's do some rolls. Good flying. Alright, here's an inversion. The inverted flight. There it is. Two 3,000 Super Tigers, 27 pounds. Go, yeah, what? make uh, one more pass. Let me get down at the end of the runway. Huh? Yeah. Want to do that? Okay, right. I'm going to shut it off and go to the end of the runway. Got it. Ryan, what do you think of that? Good, man. Just See the record in the upper right-hand corner? Mm -hmm. And if you hit it again, it'll go on. When you hit it again now, hit it again. Here it is, July 31st, 1991. We're going to fly the new uh, Future Shock. This one, uh, it was originally electric. This one's got a 6.5 in it. Do some test flying. And uh, we're, we've got a FBI out there and we're at the Sierra Scimitar Squadron field and crank this puppy up and go for a test ride. Uh, yeah, I know you're out.
experience for me in, in these uh, rudderless airplanes, the tailless airplanes, except for the vertical turn. You sure do your job. Yeah, I got it. Dang it. Uh, yeah, I lost it, Bill. Do it again, Kenny. I didn't get it. No, see, you have to be back a little. I missed that landing. I think he's going to take off again and, you know, catch the landing. Shock. Uh, this will be a lot of airplane news, but the electric in it. This is the uh, test flight with the KB 6.5. And we're going to have a little bit of fun and we're going to go back up again. Okay, I'll catch the landing the next time. Try for his second flight on the Scimitar series plane. I'll catch him on the takeoff. degrees per second, huh, Bill?
out there by Bill, so I'm gonna shut off for just a second. Yeah, I'm recording right now. Are you on the airplane? On the airplane. Okay, I'm going to do a P-60 and set it down. Okay. Coming in. Yeah. <laughs> you can you can touch it a little bit. Morning, Bill. Hi. You weren't at the last meeting, so I'm gonna give you that notice. Uh, tomorrow morning we're gonna be testing the Marathon flight plane between 7:30 and 10, so we're gonna limit any other flying while those ships. I haven't got. It. You're looking at the Future Astro, new creation by Bill Evans, with a special wound Astro Electric, capable of 18,000 RPM. This is a shot of the Astro Shocker sitting in position prior to takeoff. This will be its first flight. Flight for the future Shocker. It looks beautiful. I believe we just ran out of battery or he's throttled back. This should be good for about a 10 minute flight with the throttle control that he has. Just like a whisper. Oh, he's reduced power, still under power. Flies just all like the beautiful scimitars do. Nice low pass, full power applied. Gonna make another nice slow pass. Nice graceful turn. Coming for a beautiful low pass. Going to be coming in for his landing. Turning on to base, coming into final. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, Bill. Taxi towards me. Here we're, we're, we're taxiing towards us with the Astro Shocker. I do believe you ought to name this the Swish. It's so quiet. Taxi more, Bill. Oh, he's out of juice. Any time. This is a future. Are you recording? Yes. Okay. Just focus. Uh, I think so. This is the future shock, a second flight. It should be full throttle, 
Maximum climb. Ready? Any time, Bill. Here we go. Got it now. Here we are, October 9th, 1991. This is the Vader Down Under, Down Under in honor of the Northern Territory Scimitar Squadron in Australia. This one has a 6.5 in it. As you can see, the verticals are on the bottom. Perhaps where they belong, I don't know. But we're going to try this. This is going to be the test hop. You know, nothing is impossible until proven impossible, and then only for a period of time till someone uh, proves that it is possible. So uh, this is the first attempt we know of to run with the verticals underneath. And as you can see, we got a pair of them. And there's Darth Vader's helmet. And so this is why we call it Vader Down Under. I'm gonna crank this puppy up. And here we are, there's Mont Tom at the uh, Sierra Scimitar Squadron and so uh, we're going to get up in the air and take a look at it. How are you? <laughs> We're looking at Bill cranking up the down under. This would be the first flight. I don't know, I called it the upside down Z. There you what should we call it? Many names. Looks good. It's on, ready to go? Yeah, I had to just punch record. The what? Punch the red button? Hey, you know what? I bet I didn't do that the You're first on. time. You're Yet. Recording now. Okay. <laughs> we can see that. What's the red button for, Bill? I don't either, but have you got that thing upside down? No. Uh, well, it, we did it, guys. What? Which way? How did it go? Which way up? Well, it flies, even with the tails on the bottom. Which way was up? The verticals on the bottom. Now, either you guys have got to stand on your hands or you turn the airplane upside down. So it was a, it was a busy little, I was a busy little puppy flying this thing at first. I needed a little bit of right trim. Once I got that in, it was fine. The slow flight's good, so the effectivity of the fins, uh, is uh, okay. Uh, it worked great. It flew great. It rolled a little bit. It even climbed and it, the slow flight was good. And what do you think, guys? Hank? I think that you need to have some uh, retracts on the top so you can land it upside down if you want. Yeah, the <laughs> KMB 6.5 worked great. So did the Fataba 7 UAF. We got the servos on the bottom of the wing. Uh huh. And uh, old Darth Vader right in the back. <laughs> this will be a retake of this thing. Some dummy forgot to put the recording button on, so we're going to make a short one out of it. I think he's got the airplane upside down.
She said this is going to be a short flight. Kind of looks like a tunnel hole airplane. I think he's got it right side up. He's going to make a low pass. Which way is up? Coming in. The flight of which way is up?